an example where mental load is being added to the default parent. Hey, what are we doing for our two-year-old's birthday edition? Hey babe, what are all these boxes over here? Oh, I just got a head start on some of the gifts for our almost two-year-old. Oh, awesome. Yeah, hey, what are we doing for their, their birthday this year? Oh, well, I was the... Wait, why are you asking me as if this is my job? Oh, I just figured, you know, it's something you're typically really good at and you do a great job of it and we love it. I just want to make sure that I know what to do to work into your master plan, sort of, you know? So first off, I'm not better at these things than you. Melissa, what are you talking about? You throw bomb parties. I could never do what you do. Zach, what do you do for a living? I'm a project manager. Yeah, what do you think an event like this is? It's a project. If you can get paid $100,000 a year to do your job, I'm pretty sure you can plan a birthday. Yeah, but like you're a woman, like you're just better at these sort of things, you know? No, I don't know. Go ahead, tell me, what is it that I'm naturally better at than you? Like you always get them the gifts exactly what they want. Could never do that. You mean you could never pay close attention to what they like and want and then go ahead and execute on getting said items? When we ask our partner things like this, what are we doing for X event? We are consciously or unconsciously making them project manager of it. Project managers get paid the big bucks. They're the ones organizing the crew, getting the materials, putting things in motion. In households, the default parents are the project managers, but they're not getting the level of recognition that a project manager gets. And when he says you're just better at that kind of thing, what he's unconsciously talking about is emotional labor. She's habitually doing the emotional labor around the house, putting in the emotional and mental effort that it takes to get good gifts that create a positive emotional response from the children. Guys, if you are having conversations like this, but they're not as pleasant as the one we just had, and you want things to be better, get a relationship goals consult and look to see if some of the goals that you have might be something that I can help you out with on an ongoing basis.